Hello, babe. How are you? Oh, I'm fine. No, no, I'm at home. <laughs> Naughty you. No, no, just calling to check on you. So how is tomorrow going to be like? Okay. Uh, yo. Okay, okay, no problem. <laughs> oh my god. Love you too. Okay, bye. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> I must say I'm living a very fulfilled life. And I'm obviously happy. <laughs> mm. Not bad. Oh, oh hi! <laughs> so now there is my birthday boy. Oh, come here. <laughs> You're drinking already. Mm. It's 9 a.m. and then um, it's my day, so. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> mm. You care for some? Nah, too early. Are you sure? Oh, yeah, I remember you're not such a drinker, so it's fine. Well, you cannot deny the fact that I do not lack in the other department. I, of... I don't know what you're talking about, tell me. <laughs> <laughs> you are sleeping so peacefully, my darling. I didn't okay. want to wake you up. Oh, wow. So. I ran to the grocery store to get mm. you stuff to make you the best breakfast ever. Are you serious? Yeah. Awesome. Then I'll make a birthday lunch for you later. Awesome. Happy birthday, baby. Thank you. Mm. You, you need me to help you? I could. No, Your Majesty. Are you I sure? Can manage. Really? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you soon. See you soon too. Easy with your drink, okay? I'll try, okay? <laughs> Oh, I'm so, so sorry. I was about to eat my shower. Okay, okay, don't worry. I'll call you back. Oh, this is lovely. This is so sweet. Oh. I I think I like the red one. You know this man deserves the best. Okay, I'm waiting. Guess it's for me. Okay. Thanks so much, darling. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Okay, talk to you later.
I can't wait to say happy birthday to Desmond. Mm. <laughs> Is it only that? What else? <laughs> you and I know that I know you more than you know yourself, babes. I know how much you've spoiled this month. And today, hey, I know that you're going to bring down the roof. Today is a special day, and I know that you're going to give it to him, and give it to him, <laughs> and give it to him specially. Just get out of here. Baddest chick. <laughs> Where's my cake? Of course, it's in the car. I've brought out today to support you specially. So, I'm all for you. I'm not going anywhere. I don't get it. What do you mean? Okay. What I'm trying to say is that I will sit down here and wait for you to get ready. Then I'll drive you straight down to this month's doorpost. Oh, so that you can God. give it to him and have <laughs> Thank you so much, darling. You're welcome. Of course, that's my birthday present to him. Okay. You have to hasten up because once I drop you off, I have an appointment to catch up. Okay? Okay. I'll just go and you know what I mean? <laughs> hey, who's trying to bad girl? Hello, Mr. Ken. have called me to hasten up my steps so that I can just come up and meet you. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Just hold on. I'll be with you shortly, okay? Just hold on, please. I'm coming. <sighs> Who is that? A business call. Um, there's this company that wants to partner with my company, so they sent their delegates to come and uh, meet up with me. But do you know that the secretary has not called me since? They came since morning. Wow. This is totally unprofessional. Well, you know what, babes? We just have to go. I will look for another means to continue my journey. Oh, thank to you so me. very much. Oh, <laughs> All right. Okay, bye. I'll see you shortly. Bye. Take bye. care. All right. Ooh. No, 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 no. Yeah, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> I don't feel like I'm getting older, trust me. I feel like I'm getting way younger. Oh, right, thank you. I'll have to call you back, okay? <laughs> Bingo! <laughs> I mean, there's no better way to wash down such a sumptuous, delicious meal. Honey, it's your birthday. I love you should you, make baby. it count. I love you. No, go ahead. Okay. Let's pop this thing, baby. Yes. You know this. <laughs> You know this. Awesome, awesome, oh, awesome. Thank you, thank you. Oh my god. I can't wait. You want to win? <laughs> oh wow, awesome. Oh yeah. That's it there. Okay. Oh. Ah. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. There you go. Uh that goes out first of all. I think so. Yeah. So let me do this. Okay? Yeah, go ahead. Pop it! Mm. Yeah. yeah. Ooh! <laughs> hey, boy, you know I'm bad. I know you're bad, baby. You know I'm bad. <laughs> I know you are. <laughs> okay, so this is mm. for you. Okay. There you go. Thank you. And this is for me. Good, so. We do a toast, right? Yeah. <laughs> to the birthday boy. To us on my birthday. I know. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Wow. You. you know, I made the right choice spending this birthday quietly with you. I mean, I doubt I would have had much fun somewhere else. Trust me. Are you for real? <laughs> of course I am. You know, I wouldn't like to use with her. Sure about that? Very sure about Aww. it. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Happy birthday. Thank you, sweetheart. <laughs> so, yeah. I think it's time to cut the cake. Yeah, sure. We should cut the cake. Give me one minute. Yeah, sure.
Don't let me fall. 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 I got you, baby. Yes, I know. Mm. I know. Yeah. So now cut your cake. I will. Where do I start from? You're just really feeling yourself today, though. Yes, I am. It's my birthday. I feel 20 years younger. Oh, no, darling. If you were 20 years younger, you can't do what you do. Can you tell me what I do exactly? <clears throat> I, don't. I can't say this in public. <laughs> Are you for real? <laughs> cut public your cake. Indeed. Yeah, I will. Where do I start from? Are you expecting someone? No. Uh, are you? No. Oh, okay. It seems really happy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Happy birthday, Decorn. Excuse me. What is this? What are you doing here? What kind of a dumb African child are you, Jessica? Today is his birthday, and as his wife's best friend, I bought him a cake to wish him happy birthday. <laughs> oh, okay. You thought? is very well received, but I'm afraid you're not wanted here, so just leave. What did you just say? I said that you and whatever it is you have in there is not welcome here. So get out, get lost, disappear, as in just go away, you know, you are an intruder, you are not wanted here. Me, an intruder. Yes. That's one. Hmm? Yeah, you, you, you heard her now. Leave. You are not family, she is. Exactly. Family first, so go, please. Okay. It's time to go. Take your stuff. Get out. Thank you. How on earth does she know we're going to be home today? I don't know, she probably took a wild guess and oh, she guessed please right. Please don't give me that trash, Desmond. You told her! How would I have told her, Eve? If I did, do you think I would let you chase her? Okay then. So how does she know you were going to stay home to spend your birthday to the extent she got you a cake? How does she even know it was your birthday in the first place? She friends with me on Facebook. So I mean, she probably knew from there. <sighs> she disgusts me. Like, I hate to see her. I hate to look at her face. Like... God, and now she's ruined my mood. Hey, hey, listen, Jessica, you, you don't have to do this. Do what? I told you I don't want to see her anymore. Didn't I say that? Yeah, you did, but then... Oh. But what? But you choose to spoil everything I've done for you today and ruin everything and ruin my mood. I can't stand you right now. Je Jessica. 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 <sighs> Jessica. Jessica. Jessica, just leave me alone, okay? Just go. You, you can't ruin this day now. Today of all days. Come on, you cannot now. But you already ruined it. I doing exactly what I told you I don't like. I swear I didn't tell her anything. I'm serious. Are you... Just, just go. Jessica, come on now. You can't ruin everything that we've been getting right since this morning just because of one, one stupid girl. Just give me a minute. All right, come. Please, mm -hmm. please now, just come. I what? swear I, I, I didn't tell her anything. So what do you know? Nina! Melissa!
sir, you're back. Yes, I am. How come you didn't call me to let me know you're coming so I could come over to the airport to pick you? That's because I didn't want to let anyone know. I'm your first victim here. <laughs> so, how was your trip? Oh, it was fine. My brother and his bride, they're awesome. And they send their regards. Oh, so good to hear. And uh, where are you going with that cake? Oh, oh I got it for Desmond's uh, birthday, but... Uh, Don't tell me he rejected it. Uh, something like that. No I freaking way! How can you tone down a gift? Especially on your birthday. No, that's wrong. That's wrong. You know what? Come back in. But I will make him accept it. No but. Uh, I'm going to talk to him. Come in. I guess we came in at the right time. Please sit down and I will quickly get him upstairs. Okay. Yeah. Thank you, Mommy, sir. All right, darling, I'll be back. Okay. Yeah. Desmond. Huh? It, it's not what you think. You, you just came in and, and, and... You're sleeping with my sister. No, no, no. no. I, I can explain it. What can you explain? Melissa, it's not what you think. Do you know how long I've been standing here watching you both? <sighs> Melissa, Melissa, okay. It, it's, it's really not what you think, okay? This is what happened. Shut up! Jessica. This is my husband. Under my no, 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 Jessica, wait. Uh, uh, Melissa, wait. Melissa. Why are you holding me? Are you mad? Why are you holding me? Sorry, sorry. It's are so, you so, mad? So, I'm, I'm sorry. It's, it's, it's okay. Melissa, Melissa, no! Get out! I'm sorry, I'm sorry! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Let me deal with this here! Leave me! This month! This month!
What have I done? What have I done? What have I done? Oh. What have I done? What? Melissa, talk to me. What is it? What happened? Talk to me. You don't even want to know what I saw. What? What happened? I saw my husband and my sister in bed. What? Oh, but why would Dyson condescend so low to do such a thing? Oh, God. Oh, no. Why would this not do such a thing to me? It's so disgraceful. Sister. Melissa, Melissa, hold on. <laughs> Melissa, wait, Melissa. Melissa, wait. Melissa. Melissa! Oh! Melissa. Melissa, please open the door. Meli Melissa! Melissa, I, I know the pains you may be going through right now. Melissa, I know what it means to be betrayed by the people you so much love and cherish. But honey, locking yourself up in the room won't stop anything. Melissa, please. Please open the door. I need to talk to you. Melissa! Melissa! My sister will never forgive me. My sister will never... That's all my fault. I mean, this wouldn't have happened if... if we had gone out to celebrate. I didn't... I didn't have the slightest idea that she was going to come around. She said she was going to come back next week or so. She took us by surprise. I say to my mother, what will I say to my mother? I'm finished. I'm finished. <laughs> Jessica, Jessica, you need to calm down. I'm finished. What am I going to say to my mom? Just calm down, please, okay? What is done is done. But I can assure you I'll, I'll take care of the situation and put it under control. How could you? How could you do such a thing this? Sleeping with your wife, younger sister, is a taboo, and you know it. She told you already. Oh, what kind of temptation pushed you into doing such evil? Of all the women in the world, you choose to do it with your wife, younger sister. Have you no shame or what? Honestly, I, I am not a bit proud of what I've done. I'm, I'm really ashamed of myself. I am deeply disappointed in you, Des. You just broke my friend's heart and put internal enmity between the two sisters. Ah, is she holding up? <sighs> well, she feels so shattered and broken. She's been crying all day. She's locked herself up in the room. Oh, God. Nina. Nina, you have to help me. You have to help me talk to her. Please, I beg of you. Please. <sighs>
A lot of people were saying she shouldn't have gone for the competition. Mm. But I didn't say anything wrong with it. Most times, these people have these issues. They don't even know they have it. I know, right? But I don't think she's made any wrong decision in going in for the competition, though. The guy keeps criticizing her. Meanwhile, mm. he has his own issues as well. For me, I, I think he's a guy that talks too much. Thank you, dear. You get other people just keep saying things like how she does this and how she does this. Desmond. Desmond. Yeah. Yeah, we're all hypocrites. All these things, they don't matter. I mean, why... You're not drinking. Oh, yeah, I'm holding it out. So drink it. Hmm. So we're saying... Do you want something? Yeah, sit down. I hope there's no problem. We're not going to have any problem if you listen to what I'm about to say and adhere to it. Sis, you're scaring me. I just need you to watch how you dress in my matrimonial home. My husband is a man and he's human. It's not superhuman. You have a great body. You just should watch how you dress so that nobody gets anything confused and wouldn't start having issues. I'm not saying we're going to have any of that. I'm just saying. You, when you're in your room, you can wear whatever you want. You can be naked if you want. But when you're coming out, at least just watch what you wear and dress decently. I'm really sorry. I, I just wear stuff. I it's don't have okay. any ulterior motives. I know. Of course I know that. That's what I'm telling you. Okay. Thank you. It's fine. I love you. I love you too. I'm really sorry. It's okay. Anyway, that's all. Just continue what you are doing. I should have no more. I should have said something when I caught him looking at my sister's ass. I should have said something, but I didn't because I am a coward. That's what I am. How can my husband, my... Oh my. How am I supposed to know that he was going to take it this far? Things are really crazy, but your choice of spouse is very important. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I, I... If a woman is insulting my husband, you should leave it. If Don't worry. Is, okay. I will handle the issue. As long as you're quiet. Mm -hmm. Just... Don't worry, you will tell our children the story. <laughs> How? <laughs> Let God punish the woman that will try it. Let me do the talking. <laughs> Good afternoon. Afternoon, darling. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> I don't need to ask how you guys are doing. You seem to be having so much fun. <laughs> yeah, as you can see. You guys are so cute together. I mean, like, it is an award for the best couple. We should just go to you guys. <laughs> you know what? When you're done with the flattery, brother does he call. Oh, he did? Yes. His wedding is in two months, and then he wants you and I to come plan the wedding for him. You know mama can't travel now. Yes. He'll send us an invite, and then you'll come, right? To South Africa. Yes. <laughs> I'll go. Oh my God! Really? Yeah. <laughs> are you sure you can survive without us? Are you Are you serious now? <laughs> of course. Are you, are you guys relocating? You're just going to come back now, right? <laughs> I can manage. He'll be fine. Okay. Um, you know what? I'll come in and tell you the requirements. We need a passport and your passport. Okay. And stuff like that. Don't worry. Yeah. Right. I'll be in shortly. Thank you. 
So, baby, <laughs> if a man slaps me, what would you do? I'll kill him. Trust me. Cheers. <sighs> Is this a joke? You're not dressed? Do you realize we're going to miss this flight? I... I'm not, I'm not going to travel with you anymore. What? Do you realize I paid heavily for that ticket? It's a return ticket. Wait a minute. This is Dozier's wedding. Your only brother's wedding. Mom C cannot travel because of her health. So it's just you and I. Who's going to plan the wedding? Now that you're not going, who will do all that? I mean, I can't travel because I have this phobia for flights and I forgot to tell you. I just remember the last experience just to put a court here. It was... I will call Brother Dozier and explain to him. I'm sure he will understand. You are very stupid. You didn't know you had a phobia for flight before the ticket was bought. You didn't know you had a phobia for flight yesterday, today. It is now that it's... Are you even serious it's, at it's, all? It's, it's, it's okay, it's okay. Let's don't flare up over this issue, right? I'm just going to return the ticket for a refund. But then it's going to cost me money. I don't want you to run late, okay? Let's, let's just leave. Safe flight. didn't want to go to South Africa, I should have known that something was wrong. One minute she was happy she wanted to travel and then the next minute she had a phobia for flights. That is when I should have known. But then I trusted her. I would never have ever thought that my sister would do a thing like that to me. And my husband. I wonder what they were thinking when they were doing it. I wonder what the lies. I wonder how they look at me. And when they see me, they will look at me and say, Oh, look at this fool. Look at this useless woman. This, this, this is going to be a very big scandal if it leaks. Like, how am I supposed to face my employees at work? See, Nina, you have to help me talk to her. Help me talk to Melissa. I, I, di I didn't mean to hurt her. Help me beg her, please. Melissa is everything to me. I am I'm nothing without her. I beg of you, please. I... I I need you to help me. You should have thought of that before you condescend low to play dirty with our younger sister. I know. I know I, I messed up. I messed up really bad. But please help me talk to her. Well, I'll try. But I'm not promising you. I'll see what I can do about it. Nina, thank you. Thank you very much. I, I promise I'm going to compensate you for all the troubles when it's over. God. Melissa. Melissa, you can't do this alone. You need a shoulder to cry on. Please, Melissa, let me lend you mine. Honey, listen to me. You can count on me. I'm on your side. Please open the door. Melissa, please open the door. Melissa. Oh, 
my poor friend. Look what those bastards did to you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Look, Melissa, even if you give up on life right now, it's not going to change anything that has happened. Even the heavens fall on us right now. The fact still remains that Desmond, your husband, cheated on you with your loving sister who you so much cherish. So what do we do? You just have to forget it. I know it's hard. Or you just got to try. See, listen to me, sweetheart. In this life we live in today, shit happens. You see fathers doing it with their daughters, brothers sleeping with their sisters, grandfather raping their own granddaughters. It is not peculiar to you alone. My friend Cassandra was raped by her mother's elder brother when she was 12. The earth never stopped spinning because of that. Life must go on. Melissa, please. You just have to be strong. Please. Thank you. Hey, I guess you have to eat something. You've not taken anything since you came. No, I'm fine. I don't have appetite. Okay, I guess I shall allow the both of you talk. I'll be waiting for you. I'm sorry. Why did you do it? Why did you sleep with my sister? A little girl that was placed under my care. You choose to spoil the only relationship, the little relationship that I have with my sister. Why? I thought you have some brains. Now I know you are just brainless as you are stupid. So after all this, your arrogance and your rudeness, this is where it got you to. Getting dirty with your own sister's husband. Oh gosh, you suck. I see you've come to rub it in, witch. Arrogantly to the end. 
But, like seriously, Jessica, how could you do this to your own sister? Like, what were you thinking? Is it that no other man appealed to your perverted so or what? Because I don't get it. I know you like to be the center of attention, but today is not for you. I don't have your time. Oh, Jessica, I can see that you are shameless. You are a disgrace to womanhood. <laughs> Coming from you, you. You have no right to judge me, you backstabbing idiot. How dare you! Try it, Nina. Just give it a try. And watch me beat your ass. <sighs> well, I am not surprised. A girl who could sleep with her other sister's husband is capable of doing anything. You know what, Jessica? I am sure your late father will be weeping bitterly in his grave because of you. You dare not talk about my late father. Or what? I honestly don't know what to say. I'm just, I'm just really ashamed of myself. Hell yes! You should be ashamed of yourself. Of all the women in the world, you had to be the only girl that I had! You slept with her! What kind of a man are you? That's, that, that's not true. You, you know I really love you. I mean, everything that happened was a mistake. Exactly. Marrying you was a mistake. I loved you. I gave you my heart. I gave you everything. But you threw it away. You threw it right back at me with a slap. Any attempt you make on his life now will swiftly shift the blame from him to you. And the law will come hard on you and you may live to regret it. Please, Melissa, think about your aged mother in the village. Please. You have the nerve to walk into my house after what you have done. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. I'm so sorry. Why did you do it? I was, I was trying to help. I was trying to salvage a situation I thought you couldn't handle by yourself. I was only trying to help. You were only trying to help? by sleeping with my husband in my house. I don't know. I don't know how I got caught up in the whole web. I don't know how I got here, but I was only trying to protect you. I was only trying to protect you. Protect me? From what? From unfriendly friends like this one sitting beside you. Excuse me, you pervert so. Please don't ever mean to this your madness, oh. Uh uh. What are you talking about, Jessica? Melissa, do not give ears to this rubbish she's vomiting from her mouth. Leave her, don't worry. Let her just talk. 
Continue. It, it all started on the night you were celebrating your certificate exam. Oh, I'm so, so happy for you, Malisa, for this great accomplishment. This professional course you just finished is one big feather you just added on your cap. Congratulations, Thank you. Thank you. Ow. Thank you. Ow. You know I'm so pressed. I need to use the bathroom. Ow. <laughs> Such thank you will be good for Catherine, you know. Would you want to feel me? I think we should give honor to whom honor is due. It's not your night, it's hers. So, some other time. Well said. <laughs> I'll wait for my night to come. Yeah. But at least I can manage and kiss. Oh my, that was so, so funny. <laughs> well, I'll just be gone for four days. That is what I came to tell my friend, but of, unfortunately, I met her absent. I wasn't even expecting to see her home. Yeah, I actually brought um, some of my work back home so I could relax a bit. My manager in the office is really reliable. Oh, <laughs> I thought as much. Yeah, i would <clears throat> deliver your message as soon as she gets back, but then you should call her when you get your phone, just so you avoid... You know what I mean? <laughs> of course I will. Oh, let me run along. No My problem. friends are waiting for me. That's all right. Okay, see yeah. more of you. Right. Whew. Yeah. My baby. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to transfer the money you need for your father to your account. Uh, you should take good care of him. And then you can bring him to the city if you want. Uh, no, he's in good ends over there in the village. My mother, his wife, is always there to take care of him. Mm. He'll be fine as soon as I send him the money. Okay. If that's what you want. <laughs> uh, thanks very much for the money. That's fine. I really appreciate it. No problem. So I'll be on my way. Uh, no, we're on your way. I, I don't get it. I was thinking you would, you know, stay around. We spend time together. You know, I've missed all the pleasures that this gorgeous body of yours brings, you know, baby. Uh, can we... Yeah. Sure, why not? I mean, my wife traveled for an official assignment for her firm. And her sister, trust me, that one is fast asleep. Mm, no. I'm not comfortable here. Why don't you go to our usual place we used to meet? Oh, really? Sure, that's fine if that's what you want. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Yeah, lead the way. To watch this African film that I saved earlier. Hey, sis, you won't believe what my friend told me today. <laughs> Jessica, you and your bunch of friends, you are always having gist. I'm telling you, the weirdest thing I've ever heard in my life. My friend said that she caught her sister's husband pants down with her sister's best friend. Hmm, that's a lie. That kind of thing can only happen in the movies. No, it's real. Oh. I'm telling you, she caught them. She said that 
They even do it in her matrimonial home sometimes. God forbid. Tell me. Her matrimonial home. Tell me. What kind of a friend is that? <laughs> hey! Are you serious? No, no, no. That's not true. <laughs> mm -mm. I will kill that friend that killed my husband and kill myself. Yes! What else would you be doing in life? I cannot wish that kind of thing for even my enemy. That is... Ha! No. Ha! In fact... Uh, as wait, in a, are you leaving? You have spoiled my mood with this kind of story. How can a man leave his wife and go and be sleeping with the friend? What kind of rubbish is that? That is morally wrong. Spiritually, it's even wrong. Of all the men and all the women in the world, they couldn't see other pa partners. They had to go and cheat with each other. That's big, 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 big betrayal. That's betrayal. It's, it's very, very bad. You have to be very careful of the kind of friends you keep. You shouldn't even be aligned with people that can sleep with other people's husbands. People don't have the fear of God these days. Nobody has the fear of God. At the end of the day, they will say it is the man and it is the woman. At the end of the day, come upstairs and finish this gist too. Okay. Is this what she would do if I tell her? No, she won't hear this one from you. How am I supposed to tell her now? I, I, I can't tell her. I can't tell her. I can't tell her this. I have to find a way to sort this problem. I have to do something myself. She would lose her mind. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> well, mm. yeah, baby. Uh, come on here. Oh, Desmond. What now? You've been reckless here. Yes. Somebody could come in and Who see could, us. Who would come in? My, my wife has gone to work, and her sister has gone to school, so nobody's going to come back till about. Five, six in the evening, so we have the entire house to oh, ourselves. That's more, you are bad. Yes, I agree, I'm bad. And you are badder. <laughs> <laughs> well, that makes it to our first then. Well. Your wife was too decent to have married a bad meat. Mm. Like you. I agree, I'm a bad meat. But this meat is very sweet. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's get upstairs. Yeah. Ugh. All right, then. It's going to be a wild one, you know that, right? Making love in your bedroom makes it even cooler and enjoyable. <laughs> I know, baby. I love it too. Except the condom. Desmond, tell me, when are you going to stop using condom on me? Come on, I can't, I can't stop using condoms. I mean, you don't want to get pregnant, do you? Exactly what I want. Get me pregnant. I want to carry your baby. You are friends with my wife, best friend for that matter. Ah, uh, that's what I told you before. Melissa is too decent to have married such a bad mate like you. <laughs> but in me, 
you will find someone that shares your wild passion. I will satisfy your erotic desire like my friend can never do. I will make love to you anytime, anyhow, anywhere. You know you are playing a very dangerous game. Oh, come on! <laughs> I know the rigs involved, trust me. Thank God you know. But for now, let's stick with condoms, okay? She wants. This is what she wants. To break my sister's marriage, to destroy my sister's marriage. <laughs> I will not let this happen. I cannot let this happen. <gasps> I'm not going to tell Melissa because I know she will lose her mind. But this, I will fight it. <laughs> I will fight this. This is not going to happen. What do you want here? Uh, Jessica, what has come over you? Don't I have the right to come visit my friend in her own house again? Don't oh, I no, have you the don't right? have the right to visit your friend, my sister, when you are clearly sure she's at work by this time. So what are you doing here? In fact, I think you should go. Just go back to where you're coming from. Jessica, are you seriously talking to me in such manner? I'm talking to you in any manner that I choose. I, are you seriously talking to your sister's friend in that manner? Is there something wrong with you? Are you out of your mind? Shut up! I don't know you to be this rude. What's wrong with you? I said shut up when I'm talking. Now listen and listen very clearly. Let it be the very first and last time you would disrespect whoever comes to this house. Irrespective of who that person came to see. That's if you don't want to go back to the village. What kind of rubbish is this now? Listen, I, I won't tolerate such insolence in my house. Now get out and go and do what you are doing. Um, I'm, I'm really sorry, okay? Oh, oh, no, 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 Desmond. You just saved me from my embarrassment. But why would Jessica behave to me in such manner? At least Jessica, I know, can never be rude to me. Or has she found out about us? No, no, no. I, I, I don't think so. She's probably just in a, in a bad mood. This house, my foot. What stupid house. The house he has turned into a coven of adultery with that stupid hoe of his. Okay, well... I think I will be on my way because the atmosphere is tensed and I don't want to cause more trouble. We'll talk on phone. It's okay. That's probably the best thing to do. I'm sorry for, for the embarrassment. Okay. Talk to you See later. ya. Yeah. God, this is so frustrating. What do I do to fight this switch off without getting him to protect her? I think the only option left is just to tell Melissa. I'd... But this is, it's going to be disastrous because I'm sure she will kill everybody and kill herself. What do I do to save my sister's marriage? What do I do to get this witch to stay away from her marriage? Wait. Maybe I could get closer to Desmond. Be nicer to him. That way we can get closer and 
I could control his mind and make him forget her. Yeah, this could work. Yes, this is going to work. Oh, I cannot wait to throw that witch out of this house. I can't wait. Yes, it's going to work. Yeah, hello. Uh, yeah, I was just thinking I'd, uh, you know, call you back as soon as I get the confirmation and head to the office. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. All right, it's, it's fine. I'll, I'll talk to you later, okay? Here, bye. Good afternoon, sir. Hey, good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. I've prayed so hard that I'll meet you at home. Why are you looking so excited? <laughs> yes, I am. I just wrote my last paper for my degree exam. Oh, wow. That's, that's good news. <laughs> So I suppose you're now a graduate? Technically. Awesome. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Thank you. Thank congrats. You so yeah, congrats. Yeah. So I got this for you. I was thinking you could just celebrate with me. Wow. That's, that's very thoughtful of you. Yeah, but uh, you know I'm, I'm quite busy, so we might have to do that later. I know, but I mean, it's worth celebrating, so I'm thinking maybe you could give me five or ten minutes of your time. I mean, like, you and my sister have been such huge support to me throughout my school years, so please. All right, then, you know, I can turn you down, right? <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's go. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. Are you going somewhere? Yeah, I just want to get to the salon to get my nails trimmed and clean. You know you don't have to spend that kind of money in the salon. I can help you trim your nails. Are you serious? You can? Yes. What's difficult in that? <laughs> just sit down. Let me go to my room and get some nail stuff to help you. <laughs> All right. All right. Sit down. I'll be right back. OK. This girl is becoming more caring these days, though. Hmm? <laughs> Interesting. Could be this caring and sweet. <laughs> that means you don't really know me. I mean, you're family, so I feel like it's our responsibility to take care of each other and make each other feel loved. So, Jane. <laughs> and then you sound really matured. <laughs> well, now I know you've always questioned my maturity, right? Well, I, I'm never going to do that again, trust me. <laughs> I, I'm getting to really like you. What are you doing? Hey, come on, sweet angel. Why are you, why are you, why are you sounding this way? I'm not your angel. My sister is your angel. So please just stop. You shouldn't be acting this way. Come on. Man, you can't be pretending that you don't want me when I see that burning desire in your eyes that you want me. So stop all of this pretense and come to daddy, okay? Just stop this madness. My sister could walk in on us. How do you think she's going to react? Did you just stop? You know, you can't just wish me away from your life like that. I mean, we had an understanding and I've kept my side of the bargain. Which is? Stopping Nina from coming to this house. Doing? What is it? Can't you see I'm naked? Just, just leave, please. And so? Anyways, I think this is the perfect time to have come in 
when you just got freshly baked from the bath. I told you I won't take no for an answer. Don't dare me. You cannot do this. Okay, Pray. I am your wife's sister. And if I say no to this, it's rape. And you cannot rape your wife's sister, so just leave. <sighs> just let me worry about that, sweetheart, okay? Just go. Remember, you have to keep your side of the bargain. Just go. Don't dare me. No, no, no Don't stop, do stop! That. Jessica, calm down, all right? You've been avoiding me since the last episode. I'm sorry, I, I didn't know you were a virgin. See, I know you must really hate me in your heart right now. I'm sorry, you, you should have told me. I, I don't know if you've seen the money I sent to your account. I sent you 500,000 naira. Five, five hundred thousand for me? Yeah, I mean, it's nothing compared to the pain that I've caused you. See, Jessica, Melissa must not hear about this, please. Okay. Thank you. But on one condition, you never see Nina again and she will not come to visit you or be with you again. I swear to God, Nina is never going to step her foot into this house. Trust me, she's not going to come anywhere close to this house, I promise you. Thank you. That, 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 that's why I didn't, I didn't want to tell you anything. I didn't know how you were going to react. I, I, I didn't want you to do the wrong thing. I, I was only trying to help and I don't know why. I don't... Jessica. Desmond, do you have something to say? Melissa. I, I know this might be too much for you to handle, but I'm sorry. Happy birthday. My dear husband. <sighs> Nina. Oh, baby, do you know why I like you? Mm -mm. Tell me. You are so smart to the last word of smartness. I don't get. Why are you just telling me that? Every day, I keep on wondering how you were able to play this smart game with Desmond without his wife finding out. Babe, you are an expert. Hey! <laughs> Babe, you know what? It's about you knowing what you want. Mm -hmm. And from the look of things, Desmond is not ready to stop. He still wants to continue. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking, is it not better you go for the total package? Which is? Getting into marrying you, getting you pregnant, and by so doing, it will hasten up everything. And before you know, he will just bring you in as his wife. Ah, uh, you know what? Um, that was actually my plan, but I just want to take things one step at a time. If I'm to advise you, I'll just say you should just be fast about the whole thing. You know, they don't have a child. And once you're pregnant, he will channel all his attention towards you. <laughs> And he will go on you like super glue. I've heard you. Because he's anticipating a baby. I will do my best. <laughs> okay. You better be fast about the whole thing, no ha. Let me I do want to mind very Melissa. Please. Uh, I don't know what came over me. I know it's a devil. I'm sorry, please forgive me. It's okay. I forgive you. I mean, you've worked so hard to keep my husband. No, 
Shh. Actually, I think you should have him. Not after all you guys have done. You don't expect me to keep him, right? No. You can't dump this refuse in my territory. You can have him. You know you have to go back to Mama. At least this explanation you just gave, go and give it to her. No, no. As I... well. Or Desmond. Melissa, you have two women. They are both beautiful. Melissa, Choose Melissa, between them. I'm, uh, I'm sorry. Please, I'm, I'm begging sorry. you people. You want to make me the bad person? Is that what you want? Ah. Trying to help. I was only trying to help. Only trying when you both are done, leave my house. All of you. Melissa. I was only trying to help. I, I was only trying to help. Melissa. Melissa. You know you caused this, right? I don't Oh my God. 